Roger Parker and Andrews. Press that subscribe button and like this video. And let's get started with the show. Uh, I love Halloween, if you cannot tell. <laughs> and what I love more is uh, watching a Chucky movie. And I'll be honest, Chucky gave me nightmares when I was young and was scared of a uh, fight of dolls, even though I had a ton of them. And let's just start with the Sunday, shall we? And which I'm sure you all know by now. Chucky is a good boy doll named Tommy. But then there's a serial killer in the first movie who enters the doll so he doesn't have to go to hell. And the second Child's Play movie, Andy the boy who gets a doll in the first uh, ends up in an orphanage in the second because his mom gets sent to a mental hospital and Andy gets adopted by a foster family who has a teenage foster child and the dad does not want to accept Andy because of his trouble of the past and as the story unfolds Chucky finds his way home to Andy so he can take his body and it does not have to be stuck in a plastic doll because honestly I wouldn't want to either and as the story keeps going it's a lot of Chucky cussing and just being plain funny and let's start with the pros pros Chucky doll can still give me nightmare regardless of how old I am right now and Chucky is the classic Halloween movie everyone should watch it has the right amount of cheesiness yes and more than average acting and for an old movie I prefer the Chucky more than the new child play this classic Chucky looks more surreal than the new Chucky and I'll just explain the new Chucky looks too clean i can tell the cgi movements and the old chucky looks like an actual doll like that we all use or have and just leaves more to the imagination if you catch my drift and the whole placement of the movie went along felt like i was young again and the family bonding when andy gets fostered it just seems very real like it just seems homey and felt as I was in the movie, in the scene, in the very end of the movie, where they make the dolls and just how they put all the music together and everything, you never thought you'd get through with this. And moving on to the cons, I had to say a couple what the fudges here and there. Uh, Chuck has some funny scenes, like when he pops out of nowhere to kill the first guy in the car. No idea what it's funny to me, but it takes me out of context. And second, oh, what the fudge is when a teacher locks up Andy in the classroom. I'm like, wait, I, I really hope they don't do this or they weren't allowed to do this back then. I remember they just sent me to the principal's office. Um, so yeah. And third, what the fudge is when the girl finds out Chucky is real. Like, she did not seem one bit shocked. Um... Her acting was not the worst, but come on, be scared. I'd be shitting brakes if I thought my dog could speak. I would burn that thing to fucking ground. And But I know the movies must move along. Like, I must go to the message of this movie. Let me think. Um, yeah, no, there's nothing I can think of and I'm sure I can but I don't want this Halloween occasion and I will not I will not let my professional or judgmental side of things ruin a Halloween movie besides the fact is for sure I'll be burning the doll right away the moment my future child tells me it's alive I will pack my stuff and move away to another country not to a different state other country and last part of the show who I am I gonna recommend this movie to is um one are you afraid of dolls if so don't watch this movie two if you do love dolls and love a fun good old classic halloween movie in which you don't critique movies for a living three does not care about my opinion that's okay and if you checked all three then go ahead and watch the movie get some popcorn drinks enjoy it relax halloween season is almost over and we're gonna move on to christmas because no one pays attention to thanksgiving and i'll give you my rating either way it's a solid seven to this day i enjoy classic halloween movies they are solid anyway i'm not a professional critic or screenwriter let's agree to disagree in the comments below like this video click this flashy sign 
and I'll see you in the next one.